up to this kind of new reimagined state that she was in. And it's people from story and art and animation and the characters department really all coming together to make sure that we made her the independent, kind of fierce, interesting character that she deserved to be. You know, she's living a lost toy life. And to us, that gave, that gave us the chance to explore kind of a different side of Bo and a different version of Bo than we've ever seen before. <laughs> gente, de Jornal Nascimento na Gássia, hoje eu estou aqui em El Segundo, na Mattel, e estou aqui para conversar um pouquinho com o diretor e o produtor de Toy Story 4, Toy Story 4. How are you guys doing today? Very well, How are you? thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for your time. And this, like, bringing this story again to the screen, how, how you guys, like, collaborate to each other? Well, the two of us, we've worked on a lot of movies together, so it's very easy to do. Um, but uh, we, you know, it's, it's kind of like we just, I don't know, how, how do we collaborate? I mean, these, are, <laughs> these movies are all these massive collaborations, right? The Back at Pixar, you know, you've got the people uh, that are in story and people that are in editorial and art, and everybody's kind of bringing everything they can to make the film the best thing it can be. And especially for Toy Story, there's a real special place we have in our hearts for these characters in these films because it all started with that at Pixar, right? Toy Story was the first film uh, that we made. Toy Story 2 was the third film that we made. So it's just been a part, of, a rich part of our history. Mm -hmm. um, so it was inspiring to everybody to be back in working with these characters again and animating these characters that are kind of like old friends. We actually also had a chance to work with people that uh, worked on the very first Toy Story. So even somebody like our pr production designer, Bob Polly, designed Buzz Lightyear 25 years ago. And so mm -hmm. he's working on this film as well. So it was great to um, bring people back that have touched it from the very beginning and work hand in hand with them as well. Yeah, Buzz Lightyear is our favorite yeah. character. Oh, yes. Yes, <laughs> at home. Well, let's talk about the, the strong female characters that we have this yes. time around. Right? Yes, Giggle McDimples. Yes, yeah. I, I spoke with Ali back on Toy oh, Story. Good. Was was released. How how was bring them like to bring give life to them? It was really cool to be able to bring Bo Peep back in a way that we've never seen before, and um, that was the kind of the driving force behind making a fourth film as well. It's just how can we reintroduce this character in a very cool way that's different from anything we've ever seen, um, and, and in order to affect Woody, in order to make him make force him to make a decision. So we, a lot of work went into making her as cool as she can be and as, as different and as um, inspiring as she could be. There's a special documentary on the Blu-ray that's about the creation of Bo Peep and in that audiences are going to get to see all the people that were really invested and involved in kind of bringing Bo up to this kind of new reimagined state that she was in and it's people from story and art and animation and the characters department really all coming together to make sure that we made her the independent, kind of fierce, interesting character that she deserved to be. You know, she's living a lost toy life. And to us, that gave, that gave us the chance to explore kind of a different side of Bo and a different version of Bo than we've ever seen before. Yeah, which is great. And Gabi Gabi, which everybody fell yes. in love with her. Yes. Yeah, that was a really fun um, character to, to play with because we wanted to feel so scary and intimidating at first and then to have the audience completely change the, you know, their opinion of her mm -hmm. and start all of a sudden feel bad for her was, um, at first we were like, can we even pull this off? But then it was, that became a real fun challenge to, to go back. If you watch the movie again on, on Blu-ray, you'll see that she's actually not a villain. She's, she, she has um, a goal and she'll do anything to get that goal, but she's not, um, she's not being mean and she just doesn't know how to communicate what she needs really and so Woody can, is able to see past that and help her out. Yeah. What else we're going to find on the Blu-ray? So there's a lot of great little documentaries. Um, one of them is about people's favorite toys when they were children. Uh, there's great interviews with the cast and with the crew talking about their favorite kind of toys that really meant a lot to them when they were children. Um, there is, like I said, the one about Bo Peep. There's a great one about the relationship between Buzz and Woody through the years. Mm -hmm. and, and it's a lot of, it's a deep dive with Tom Hanks and Tim Allen talking about the relationship of those two characters 
for 25 years, you know, playing these characters and, and, and all that they go through. So that's a special piece. And there's a lot of deleted scenes. There's a, we, made, we made a lot of Toy Story 4 over the years. I bet you. There is a lot. Much be a lot of them, right? Yes. And yes. so there's a lot of deleted scenes that are show the, the kind of the different paths we went down that are pretty wild and and uh, they're, a lot, they're really entertaining, but they just didn't work out for different reasons. So. Right. And to wrap it up, what is your favorite character? Favorite new character, I would go with Forky. I just love him. He's a new character, not like anyone we've ever seen before, handcrafted by a child, then springing to life. Um, his innocence and just his humor and uh, just lack of knowledge about the world it just makes him really fun to watch. I love Duke Kaboom. I think he's um, a fun character that just... Uh, uh, People tend to kind of remember toys like that they played with, and so to have a toy that was so disappointed by his own <laughs> by his own commercial <laughs> and how he couldn't live up to it, that just for some reason that just that clicks with the the child in me that watched all those commercials and was like, oh, I wish the toy was that cool. So uh, he's just a lot of fun, and Keanu Reeves did an amazing job in the voice. Yes. We, lo we love. I Keanu. think you'll go places. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. And October first is the digital. That's right. And Blu-ray and DVD October eighth. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much. He is the most important toy to Bonnie right now. Hi. Hi. I'm trash. We all have to make sure nothing yeah. happens to Forky. What <laughs> uh, Something happened to him. Do I need to be worried? Well, my guys are veterans. They'll hang in there. No. Ah. Hey, watch it, Where buddy. Where do we go? On my way, Woody! <laughs> oh. Hold on! Let's ride! Oh yeah, he's posing. To infinity and my boy! Jesse, Ham, Buzz, Rex, Forky! Wait, it's an actual fork? <laughs> How do we get that key? What about the old plush rush? Oh. Where did you two come from? Well, we're not doing that.